Uh, we're looking really nice today. 56 degrees outside here in Tampa, 49 in Newport Ritchie. You get the, into the mid and lower 40s as you work your way to our north, but everybody's starting out lots of clear skies. We do have a little bit of patchy fog up towards Brooksville. We've seen some patchy fog over towards Brandon, so you're heading out first thing in the morning. Uh, just kind of keep that in the, uh, in the back of your mind. You may deal with at least some of this fog as we go through the next couple of hours, but most of it is pretty patchy. Uh, 59 in Miami, uh, same uh, or actually 58 degrees in West Palm, 52 for Vero Beach, and then you get into some 40s and some 50s up across the northern part of the state with uh, Tallahassee currently at 57 degrees. These dew point numbers still at pretty comfortable levels. When you get these numbers in the 40s and the 50s, it feels nice. That, that humidity is under control, but the winds are coming up now from more of a southerly direction, so we're going to start to creep this number up as we go through the next few days. We're at that comfortable level now, and then, not that it's uncomfortable, but it's going to feel a little bit more more humid as we head towards the end of the week with that suddenly wind which brings in the moisture it's also going to warm these temperatures up so over the next few days we're going to start to see more and more of us climbing into the 80s so this warming trend it started over the weekend and we will continue to warm these temperatures up as we go through the week high pressure sitting on to our east and really it's pretty quiet across a good portion of the southeast you look in the kentucky and tennessee there is a little bit of rain working its way through there and then as we move up to the north you're seeing more and more of these areas with some snow so while we're really enjoying some nice spring weather well, other parts of the country still dealing with winter weather. And then uh, places like uh, Illinois over towards Indiana later on today into this evening, they will be dealing with the possibility of some severe weather, an enhanced risk of seeing some of those uh, stronger storms. Kind of unusual to see that this early on in the season, but uh, we are really starting the transition more towards that springtime routine, seeing a lot of warm temperatures across the eastern third of the country while it's still fighting some of that winter weather across the country. But what we have is just warming temperatures. Winds coming up from the south, loads of sunshine for today. Gorgeous looking day with those daytime highs into the upper 70s. We'll continue to warm up as we head into Wednesday. A few more clouds, but then here comes cold front pushing down across the state. But this front's going to be pretty weak. We'll see mainly some clouds with this front couple of showers as we head towards the weekend. The winds switch the direction around more towards a northerly direction, but there's not a lot of cold air sitting just to our north. And you see how quickly as we head towards Friday, those winds switch right back around. And so we're just not going to cool these temperatures down all that much. Gorgeous looking day for today, mainly sunny skies. These daytime highs, 70s along the coastline. And then we're going to start seeing some of these 80s showing up as you move away from the coastline starting today. Mainly sunny skies, warming trend continues, 77 here in Tampa. And then for tonight, mostly clear and mild, uh, low temperature down to 62. For tomorrow, looks nice as well. Look at that daytime high climbing up a little bit higher. Daytime high at 79 degrees. On the water, winds are out of the southeast at 5 to 10 knots. Seas one foot or less. High tide, that comes up at 323 this afternoon. Seven-day forecast. We just continue to warm these temperatures up as we head through the week. Cold front heads our way. A latter part of the week, that's going to start to bring in a few clouds. And we'll bump that rain chance up to about 20 to 30% as we go through the weekend. Walter.